now in this video we will learn about the quartic equation roots uh, quartic equation basically is a polynomial or equation in which the um, uh, maximum uh, degree of uh, variable is 4 so if ax square plus bx cube plus cx square plus dx plus e is a quartic equation and uh, in this equation we have we will have four roots so we will denote the four roots by alpha beta gamma and nu will be delta or its roots then uh, according to white as a formulas alpha plus beta sum of all roots will be minus b over a coefficient of x cube divided by a with negative sign next will be the product now how can we find the product now keep in mind first of all we will find the product of alpha beta plus beta gamma plus gamma delta and now we will do the converse product delta alpha delta beta delta gamma right as uh, you will find six uh, entities right and their sum will be equal to coefficient of x square divided by a c over a right next product will be the product of three how can we write it alpha beta gamma plus alpha beta delta then take beta delta alpha beta gamma delta and then alpha gamma delta and so it will repeat itself but it will be minus d over a with the negative sign right coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x4 and at the last will be the product of our roots which is alpha beta gamma delta and it will be equal to constant divided by a right now there are these roots it is uh, a little bit long to lengthy to write them so for our convenience what we will do uh, for the sum of roots we will uh, it can be written as summation alpha the sign of summation alpha and here it can be written as summation alpha beta because there is product of two and here will be the product of three it can be written as summation alpha beta gamma and the last is alpha beta gamma delta that is here now in the next uh, we how, how can we solve the question in this question a quartic equation has roots alpha beta gamma written as where summation alpha is given four summation alpha beta is 5.5 summation alpha beta gamma value is minus 8 given and alpha beta gamma delta value is given 6 and they have given us the coefficient of x4 is 2 and he is asking find the quartic equation right because we have to find the quartic equation so with the help of these summations we can find the values of a b c d and e and the just you will Put the values of a b c d and e in this equation then you will get the quartic equation with the given summation of roots now see, summation of alpha it's our b and it will be equal to minus b over a because we know about this here uh, already we know that this formula minus b over a and this summation is given that it is equal to 4 so in this formula minus b over a I just put the value of summation of alpha which is 4 here put the value of a as 2 because given the coefficient of x4 is given that it is 2 so coefficient of 4 mean it is the value of a right so the value of a is given 2 so i just put the value of a2 here and then 
by cross multiplication it will give you the value of b as minus 8 right in front of you then they have given summation alpha beta value as 5.5 and we know summation alpha beta it's equal to c over a so i just put c over a is equal to 5.5 and the value of a again is given to the coefficient of x4 put the value of 2 and then by cross multiplication you will get the value of c similarly they have given the coefficient summation alpha beta gamma as minus 8 and you know summation alpha beta gamma is equal to minus d over a so i put minus d over a is equal to the value of this summation which is minus 8 you can check it here this minus d over a is equal to summation of alpha beta gamma and summation of alpha beta gamma is given minus 8 so i just put minus d over a is equal to minus 8 right now we know the value of uh, um, a which is the coefficient of x4 i just put its value and by simplification it gives me the value of d which is 16 now we will go further the product of alpha beta gamma delta is given as 6 and you know the product of alpha beta delta gamma is equal to e over a so i put e over a is equal to its value which is 6 here you can see 6 so e over a is equal to 6 by this in this case put the value of a as 2 and you will get the value of a is equal to 12 now we have found the value of b c d e and already they have given the coefficient of x4 is 2 which is the value of a so in this quartic equation just put the values of a b c d and e and you will get your required quartic equation so i just put the values of a b c d and e is equal to 0 and in this way we will find the quartic equation by giving the roots with the help of giving roots whatever they have given us <coughs> here is the solution you will find it very easy these are the four roots i have explained earlier about the roots and what is the formula this is why it has formula and it can be written as summation of a alpha summation alpha beta two products will be written three products will be written summation alpha beta gamma and then in this example you you can easily find the values of b c d e with the help of one coefficient of x4 is given as 2 1 is given so a value is given as 2 use this value in this formula and you can easily find the quartic equation hopefully you can understand it